Hello everyone. Well, I don't know about anyone else, but where I'm at right now, it's been absolutely glorious weather today. Beautiful, red hot. Um, my children, however, um, seem to think it's going to snow. I've noticed the, uh, they've got the sledge out for some reason. Um, maybe they know something that we don't. I don't know. So yeah, second night on a trot. What a treat. Clear skies. Um, who'd thought it after the month we've had? Or at least I've had anyway. So last night I was out, I doubled up on my rigs um, with this rig uh, that I'll take you through in a second. Uh, I was capturing some more data on the Iris Nebula. Um, it's getting there and uh, I think maybe in a couple more hours and I'll be happy it'll be uh, finished. But it is coming along. Um, with the other rig I was capturing uh, in around the star Seda which is in the constellation Cygnus. And I was using my Canon 77D, which is DSLR, and the Red Cat 51 from William Optics, um, and that was mounted on my Star Venture Pro. Well, tonight I'm going back to the same constellation and the same star, but instead tonight I'm going to be using my EQ6R Pro from Skywatcher and my 533MC Pro and the scope I'm going to be using uh, from William Optics, there's an Start 61, which are both underneath these scopes that I've yet to take off in a minute. So, you are more than welcome to join me for potentially another glorious clear night of astrophotography here in my backyard in North East England. room to spare so I think what I'll do now I'll just show you the exposures that are or one of the exposures that I took last night of the Seda region I haven't actually processed any data yet uh, I'm doing other stuff today so I'm, I've yet to do that but yeah I'll just uh, we'll hop on to the desktop and I'll take you through that now all right so this is one of the raw images of uh, this star here it's Seda and this is right out there that of the uh, 77D. I'll just bring this up a bit so you can see it a bit better. That's so all. That's the field of view, uncropped, uh, with the DSLR. Let's just make sure with these are all up. So I've got the 533MC Pro and the ZS61 up. Here we are, Cygnus, Constellation Cygnus, the Swan. So this is Seda, is the centre star but it's also the intersection point for the northern cross so if we just zoom in here say this sits at around 1800 light years away from earth and the designation for this is ic1318 i believe um i think that's what they're referring to this uh nebula here. or nebula area so yeah, basically this is what I'm aiming for. How I'm going to frame up, I'm not quite sure, um, but it's going to be roughly that. Uh, maybe tip it on its side, maybe so I can crop it out a little. Um, but we'll see how it goes. Well, it's a lovely morning. <laughs> Birds are chirping away. We've gone quiet now, there was a, uh, we were going absolutely nuts about five minutes ago. So I'm uh, a little annoyed at myself, I fell asleep, uh, tried to catch up on a bit of sleep and I didn't wake up from the alarm, <laughs> so I missed out on about an hour and a half worth of data possibly could have got, but it's not all bad, I've managed to get about two, two and a half hours. And the exposures don't look too bad, so I'll, I'll show you the exposure at the end of the uh, video. Along with hopefully a, 
an image if I can scrape together with that data. I'm going off past experience, so usually the case you know, this this type of target I can get away with about two, two and a half hours. Um, obviously it's more the better, but we'll see. We'll see how it goes. <laughs> Ended up uh, taking uh, four minute exposures uh, at the Unity game, which is for this camera it's the 100 irons offset 70 as well. Um, I'm sort of still finding my feet on all this uh, with settings and exposure times. Uh, this camera is really sensitive. I've been doing a bit of research as you do when you get new gear. At the moment, I'm, I'm happy with the Unity gain, which is the sort of, uh, shall we say, the optimum uh, setting for it. Um, of course, you can sort of shuffle it around and that, but I'm happy where I am at the moment and uh, just find my feet, like I said. So that is, that's all I've got for you, uh, I hope you enjoyed the video, uh, a little disjointed show to say I've made fall asleep, I did have a few more things to say but I suppose that I could save them for a, another day, another night. Uh, if I manage to get this in the script together, I hope you enjoy it, um, and on that note, wish everyone clear skies, take care, and bye for now.